when we're talking about back pain, mind you, back pain can actually come from multiple causes. This is your back. We have your sacrum right here. We have the lumbar spine, which is the backbone right here. We have your hip bone. You can think about back pain itself being differentiated into two types. We have axial back pain, which is pain at the back itself. Axial back pain may be caused by the muscles itself, which is not pictured here. We may offer injections such as trigger point injections to help release the tension in the air of that muscle. Axial low back pain also may come from these joints right here, which are the facet joints, which help facilitate the bending and twisting of the back. We also offer facet injections to help the pain in that area, as well as radio frequency ablation, where we can also, with high intensity needles, help treat the pain of these facet joints in that area. If patients come in with buttock pain, again, the pain may be coming from the underlying tissue itself, such as the piriformis, which we can inject and help relax the muscle, not unlike massage. And it may also be coming from the joint of this sacroiliac joint where the sacrum, which is this bone right here, connects to the ilium, which is part of the hip bone here, which we can also treat. Uh, number two, if patients complain of back pain that radiate into the lower extremity, it may be coming from a disc herniation causing a pinched nerve in there of the back. These can be alleviated by what we call epidural injections. So again, these are minimally invasive procedures that we do under, under local anesthetic. Mind you, these are not surgeries. With two different types, we can go straight on, which we call an interlaminar epidural steroid injection, or we can go from the bottom to the tailbone, and this procedure is called a caudal epidural steroid injection. In addition to with the epidural injection as well, we can also be selective in terms of the nerve that we treat. So if, for example, we diagnose through electrodiagnostic studies an L5 radiculopathy, we can go directly to the L5 nerve group coming from a side approach per se, and this is also called a transferamal epidural steroid injection to selectively block specific nerves in the area of the back to help alleviate the pain, not only in the back, but also down the extremity.